David Batula, CEO of Profi.me, reaching out to Andy Bashir at Ken, you know, in Kentucky. Uh, we noticed uh, from our tables the life expectancy of Kentuckians is lower than you or I would care to have. Um, and also that uh, there were uh, 10 hospitals, 10 rural hospitals that closed in Kentucky uh, since 2006, something that's a health healthcare financing uh, fiasco. And so we wanted to reach out to your office because we know that there are solutions that will work for Kentuckians um, to help increase your life expectancy, which can include uh, reopening any one of those you know, 10 or more hospitals in disease clusters as a specialty hospital in ways that are designed to increase life expectancy of Kentuckians. That happens to be part of what um, the state of Minnesota did with the Mayo Brothers of opening a rural hospital in Rochester, Minnesota. There's only 80,000 people in Rochester today and yet has one of the best hospitals in America. And unfortunately, Kentucky lost 10 hospitals in these rural areas where they're absolutely excellent opportunities to invest uh, in communities uh, where it lures physicians in the community and medical scientists into the community um, that uh, want to be there, that want to care for folks. And so we wanted to get on your schedule to look at these 10 closed hospitals and what opportunity there is for specialty hospitals that will increase the life expectancy of Kentuckians. So um, reach out to us at Profi.me.